Thanks to nicotine, the addictive compound found in tobacco, quitting cigarettes can be tough, very tough. Many smokers have turned to vaping to ease the transition. With the help of vaping, withdrawal symptoms such as hunger pains, dizziness, and irritability can be a lot easier to handle. For this reason, the last few years have seen the popularity of vaping rise dramatically until someone tripped on the cord and stopped the music. An increasing number of vaping-related injuries has turned something perceived as benign into something seen as possibly dangerous, and even deadly. According to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, as of October 2019, there have been 1,299 e-cigarette and vape-related lung injuries. What's behind these injuries? Data suggests that sustained exposure to cannabis compound THC and vitamin E acetate have played a role. Vaping is now regulated across the U.S. with New York, Michigan, Massachusetts, Ohio, California, Washington, and Oregon going all in on e-cigarette bans. Despite the current challenges, vaping still stands as a means to lessen cigarette consumption and eventually kick the habit.